Hey Figs! Thank you for the opportunity to apply for the new Icons Grant Scholarship. My name is Gwen, I live in Northern Virginia, I'm 28 years old, and I'm going back to school to be a medical doctor. I ordered some figs for the first time the other day and received a scholarship email, so here we go. Every day, I'm putting in hours towards my future in medicine, whether it's working, studying, or volunteering in the field, and always with a thermos of black coffee. I graduated college in 2015 as a varsity runner and swimmer with a degree in environmental science and art history. This starts chapter one. Throughout high school and college, I was outside all the time, always training or coaching. The more drastic the tan line, the more hours of work I was putting in. At least that's how I thought with the conjecture in my brain at the time. After college, I became a corporate accountant. And three years later in 2018, at the age of 25, a mole on my right anterior thigh came back positive for melanoma. I'm incredibly lucky to have a super talented dermatologist named Dr. Tadros, who referred me to my surgeon, Dr. Hafner. Without their expert care, I don't know if I would be healthy today or still battling cancer. I was diagnosed and treated in a two month window and then on to recovery. It's 2020 and my checkups are all cancer free. One of my friends likes to introduce me as the reason she wears sunscreen. This is probably because I tell everyone about the importance of wearing sunscreen, no matter the season, the weather, or the temperature. It's awesome to already be inspiring someone my age to make the right medical choice, but I would love to make a larger impact. Educating my peers and other young people on the importance of sun protection and skincare is important to me and the driving force that gets me out of bed every day. This experience, like many other people who have gone through something similar, made me prioritize how I spend my time in a more effective fashion. In 2019, chapter two began. I took time off from my accounting career and I started to medical scribe and shadowed my prior excision surgeon, Dr. Hafner, in the hospital. These experiences opened my eyes to the daily grind in the medical field, but it ignited a passion in me that I didn't know was there. I ended up returning to my corporate job. I've dedicated all my off hours to career change and becoming a doctor. I want to educate people. I want to inform them, but I want to do it with hours of expertise and knowledge and academic training in my pocket so I can be the best provider possible. I got my certification as a nationally registered ENT this past spring, and I now volunteer at the station in my town. This fall, I enrolled at George Mason University as a master's in biology with a focus in clinical research and translational medicine. Each class is a ton of work. I'm learning amazing things that I never knew. And I'm able to connect this um, like book and academic knowledge with personal experience and shadowing experience. Um, going to school now, it's a lot different than undergrad. I'm doing it for myself. I'm doing it by myself but I just keep wanting to know more and to continue down this path. Um, now we come to chapter three. As of last week, I put in my two weeks at the accounting company so I can begin working as medical assistant in Dr. Tadros's office. It's a significant pay cut, but I'm excited for every facet of my life to be focused on learning medicine, either at work, volunteering, or when I'm in class. I'm grateful to have a job through this pandemic but I'm barely able to make rent, groceries, gas, and of course, tuition and books. This new Icon Scholarship from FIGS would cover my tuition for the entirety of my master's program up through prepping and taking the MCAT prior to going to medical school. Thanks again, FIGS, for offering the scholarship to five lucky people out there. I'm sure whoever the recipients are, they'll do awesome things and make a great impact. Also, thanks FIGS for making clothing that I can't wear I can't wait to wear for the rest of my life. Have a good one.